Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark on the Ragnarok server, and today we are breeding our griffins. If you guys remember from the last episode where we got our phoenix, we actually installed two new mods, the phoenix mod and then another mod that adds in an item that you can feed to creatures and it allows them to be uh, breedable essentially. So we're going to be breeding our griffins here today, and I don't know if we're going to go for mutations, we'll see, uh, but I definitely want to see what what like an imprinted griffin could actually do in survival, because we haven't actually had one before. Obviously we've done a little bit of griffin breeding in our mutation factory series but you know that was all like sciencey stuff we weren't actually properly using them or anything like that so i definitely want to see the power of these things uh so let me see i don't know they should be breeding but for some reason they're not i was testing this a couple minutes ago i think with this thing occasionally okay what the hell oh, uh, occasionally i think you have to re like refeed them or something i'm not exactly sure I think, for some reason, they're not showing their gender, and from what I know about this mod, if you feed it to a creature, it can actually change the creature's gender, so maybe we just need to get them to be the same gender. Or the opposite genders, not the same gender. <laughs> so, I don't know. I'm gonna work at this for a couple minutes, try to get the breeding and everything. Um, but, uh, yeah, we're gonna have some awesome baby griffins, which is really handy, like, using this mod instead of the other mod that uh, is available. It's like a griffin taming and breeding mod where essentially it adds in a different griffin called the king griffin and you can tame those and they can be bred and everything because they have genders but the problem with that is I don't I don't get to use my current griffins like these are just rendered useless so that's the whole point of like using this instead and it's going to be really handy when we're using them on our wyverns and everything to breed those guys so I'm really excited to actually to just get going with some of these amazing uh, creatures that we can now breed for some reason they're not breeding though and I don't know why uh, let me just Oh, now they're breeding. See? I don't know what that was, but now they're breeding. Okay. I'm just going to sit here. We're going to try and get these things bred up. I don't know which one's going to poop out the baby because I seriously don't know which one's the male and which one's the female. They're not showing gender at all for some reason. Now they're not breeding. What is happening? Okay. Well, we're going to try and figure this out and we'll be back in a little bit. Oh my god. I didn't even notice. Hey. What the hell? How is there two of them? I'm so confused. Did they both have a baby? Okay, well, we got we got two baby griffins now. Uh, they, they don't look like they're mutated. But we have two of them. Amazing. Okay, let me see. No, no mutations. But they do look really awesome. Look at this one here. He's got some, like, light colors on him. I don't know why they're not breeding again. A little bit confused. All right, let's, uh, let's take out this wall. Because we got to get these babies out of here. Um, if I take... Yeah, that should be fine. All right. Babies, follow me. Uh, let's take that away so I can actually get frames. For some reason, we're still having that issue where, for like, I don't know why, we're not getting very many frames when we have our hood on in the base, and I don't know what it is. It's, like, terrible. As you guys can see, like, this is, this shouldn't be happening. I don't know what it is, but, yeah, a lot of people were saying maybe there's, like, babies or something stuck underneath the world. I already checked. There isn't, so not exactly sure why that's still happening. Okay, so these are the same. They look like they were different, so obviously they were twins. Uh, holy crap, they look amazing, though. <laughs> look at the little guys. All right, so pretty good stats on them, actually. Uh, yeah, pretty awesome. All right, uh, let me let me see. Got to get these guys off of Wonder and unfollow on them. Cool. So these get these two are breeding again. It seems I I don't know. I thought they'd lay like an egg or something, but they didn't, which is kind of confusing. I I honestly thought that they would. So because they're I mean uh, they're part mammal, part bird. So I guess it. It's kind of confusing. I know that the mod that adds in the breedable griffins, actually, they, they, I guess they actually laid their own egg. I think it's like a custom egg or something. Oh, what the hell? Oh, okay, I think, yeah, okay. No, one of them just got impregnated. I'm not sure which one's the male and which one's the female. I think this one here is the female, but oh god, what are you doing? But uh, it's really hard to tell. <laughs> so do these have genders then? No? No genders, okay. Interesting. This is really confusing, the way that they don't actually have their own genders. I don't know. Either way, we have two baby griffins. Very glitchy looking. They seem to grow pretty fast as well. Uh, we gotta get them some food though. Oh no, they might be okay. Yeah, they should be okay for the moment. Actually, you know what? I'll just grab them some anyway. Not gonna hurt at all. Got plenty of meat in here. I do need to grab some more fish meat at some point. Alright, so... Here you are. Uh, oh. Here you are. And I'll take back half of that as well, actually. Sweet. Okay. So, are these two breeding again? 
They should be. I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, man. Look at this thing. Hello. Okay, I think... I think it should be popping out any second now, but I'm not sure. I don't know. It doesn't look like it's pregnant. Either of them are. Uh, I don't know. This one here looks like it has a bigger belly, though. Hmm. <laughs> I seriously... I can't... I don't... Like, I don't know which one is pregnant. I wasn't watching the last time when they popped out. But uh, these guys look freaking amazing, though. Baby griffins are adorable. Let me see. I want to see them run. Uh, no, we got to get them on follow. No, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. There we go. Stupid non-frames. Let's head over here. I still have no pants on. <laughs> Look at these little guys. Oh, I thought that was my spyglass. Uh, there we go. Look at them. <laughs> Alright, we might have another one already. Let's go check. Oh, yay, there it is. Hey. You look the exact same. Kind of. Let me see. Do you have any mutations? Stats look all the same. No mutations. Okay, well, we're probably... I don't know. I, I think I want to imprint maybe one of these or something. Uh, I don't need all three, obviously. So, oh, God, what the hell? Stop. <laughs> I don't need all three, so I'm probably just going to imprint one of them. It's probably going to be one of these ones here. And uh, we'll probably just dispose of the rest of them. Pixel lives matter. It's okay. Um, so, yeah. I think I'll see you guys back in whatever amount of minutes. Uh, five minutes? Five minutes. Okay, so, this griffin wants cuddle. Oh, I thought he's gonna flap, flap his frickin' wigs or something. That would've been amazing. Alright, let's give him that. Uh, he's a little bit bloody, actually. I guess he just- oh my god! Oh, he got a full imprint! What the hell? Why? How did he get a full imprint from one imprint? That shouldn't have happened. That is so confusing. I think- I don't know, because I know what happens with most modded creatures. You get, like- if you play like Anunnaki or something like that, uh, when you imprint creatures, for some reason you get 100% on the first imprint. So maybe that's what happens with the way that this mod is like made or something. I'm so confused, but 100% on the first imprint. Like I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna argue with that. Like that's pretty nice, but it's kind of weird. I mean, it kind of takes a little bit of like the challenge out of it, which I don't know. I don't know if I don't know how I feel about that. That's a little bit weird. Anyway, do we have any more Griffins in here? Uh, have any, like, oh, there's one. Hey, how the hell did you get out? What are you? Are you mutated? Nope. Okay, uh, is there any more around here? It's a pity I can't actually tell their gender, because then I could put in more females. So what I might be doing is just, like, popping in more of the same color and then trying to figure out if they get pregnant or not. I don't know, it's really confusing. But, uh, yeah, I mean, like, we've... I thought it would probably take a little bit longer to do this, but we've got a fully imprinted griffin here, so... I think we'll set this one aside for the moment. Uh, is it on follow? Let me see. Yeah, you're on follow. Alright, follow me over here. I think we'll just set this one aside for the moment, let it grow up, because it's in range of a trough. It's past... probably past 10%, I think. Let me see. Yeah, you're past 10%. So he's he's going to grow up completely fine. And then we'll test him out in a little bit. Oh my god, what the hell? Look at it. Look at the colors on this one. Let me see. Disable wandering. Uh, let me see. Holy crap, that is a nice color. He's got like most of the colors of uh, door. And then he's got like a little bit of the color from uh, P tier. So that's kind of cool. Huh. All right, well, I guess we're going to do some more griffin breeding because we have to wait for this one to fully grow up. It's probably going to take at least over an hour anyway, so we can get plenty more babies going here. So, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in a little bit with some more babies. Hopefully mutated. We'll see. <laughs> well, we have a mutation, and I tried to get in here, and I can't move now. <laughs> I'm completely stuck, but you can see it over there. Look, here, let me... Can I spyglass it? <laughs> you can see its butt is blue. Oh my god, let me out of here. Alright, let me see. If I mount onto this one, I still can't move. Oh, hey, hey, I, okay, I got out. Perfect. Uh, oh my god, they're so glitchy. Oh man, look at this thing. It's got, it's like, the cool one. It got the cool one's colors. Oh man, let me, let me claim you really quick. There we go. Hello, little guy. Oh, crap. Stop. <laughs> oh my god. Let me, let me in. There we go. No. Okay, I think I got it. So here it is. It's got its mutation. Amazing. Look at that blue, though. That is insane looking. Okay, stop. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, please let me in there. All right, I gotta get this thing out of here. Uh, where do I have my demo gun? Okay, here it is. All right, follow me. Uh, the frames, seriously. Come here, buddy. Is he coming? There's another one out here somewhere. I saw it leave, but uh, I don't know where it went. I think it's over there by the T-Rexes. I think it just pooped onto it. Um, let me chuck down the wall again here. Oh, man. So this one here, is this one fully grown yet? I don't think it is. No, it's almost done, though. 88%. So I've been at this a little while. We have quite... Is that another one right there? Okay, no, that's his claws. We have quite a few uh, babies... Okay, that one doesn't look like it's mutated. Let me just have another look. Um, if it is, it's just a stat mutation. I'm mostly just looking for color mutations, so we'll just uh, we'll phoenix this one up here really quick. <laughs> I've been getting a lot of uh, prime using the phoenix. Oh, we're in. What are we in? K mode or something? Okay, there we go. So uh, let's just phoenix this one up here really quick. Actually, gives my phoenix some levels as well, which is really good. Because it counts as, like, killing a griffin. If you have, like, baby wyverns or something, kill them with your creatures. It's amazing. You get a bunch of XP. And also, with this guy, I get a bunch of meat. See? Oh, God, no, whoa, no, what? What's happening? What are you doing? What the hell just happened? These guys are... You were supposed to be on passive. How the hell did that just happen? Okay, well, I'm confused about that. That has not happened at all today. Come on over here, guys. Jesus. Oh my god. I'm so confused. Like, why did they just randomly get in there and attack? Were they hungry? They're in range of a trough, so that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But uh, yeah, let's check out our cool mutated griffin. It's got blue on its butt. It's got blue on its sides as well, and its underbelly a little bit. Oh man, that looks amazing. Uh, so disable wandering. There we go. Perfect. So, I mean, like, that's not too many griffins. I'd say probably maybe 30 griffins and we have this one now. So that's pretty cool. Definitely amazing. Uh, I'm just thinking of, like, what other colors I would want to combine with this. Because, like, that looks pretty cool. But, like, with the white, I think it looks cool. If we could get something that could replace, like, the, uh, the wings and the top there with, like, a decent color, I think I'd kind of like the white and the blue together. I don't know. We'll see. We'll definitely see. But this is a new griffin that I have to imprint now. <laughs> uh, what? Where did where did it get its stat bonus? I think probably food. Everything else looks pretty standard. All right, cool. Uh, let me check your oxygen actually really quick. Six sixty. Yeah, I think it got a. I think it got like a mutation in food. Interesting. Okay, cool. Uh, we got some more silica pearls. So so handy. Was that silica or was that black? Okay, we got silica pearls that time. Do we have any more babies in here? Oh, God, I can't even see. That's been happening a lot. Because <laughs> the dust cloud that they create when they walk, it makes it really difficult to actually even see in here. Oh, we got one in the corner there. What are you? Uh, it doesn't look like a mutation. Let me see the front. No, it doesn't look like one. All right, pretty cool, though. Oh, man. All right. Well, uh, we're almost done with the imprinting on... Or not the imprinting. With the one that's growing up, the one that we did imprint. Uh, what are you on now? 91? Okay. A little bit longer, uh, but we're obviously going to be imprinting this one here and eventually uh, getting this one fully grown up and everything. And what I'll probably do is I'll probably like keep this one aside for now and uh, we'll try out this one in a little bit. And um, I want to get like a good few... Uh, mutated ones together and then try to combine them and make like a really cool looking uh, griffin and that could be like our main griffin from now on so yeah that's kind of that's kind of the plan here um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to kill that one without hurting these two so yeah oh man all right well we gotta wait for this one to grow up we gotta imprint how long do we have left uh, five minutes awesome okay we'll be back so the mutated one wants dodo kibble head back over and feed it also we got to check the pit again all right here we go let's check that there and nice here you go buddy <laughs> oh nice okay so he's fully imprinted because of that weird glitch or whatever i'm kind of happy and i'm kind of unhappy about that i don't know <laughs> i mean it's good it saves me time but i don't know it seems a little bit cheap 
because you do have to like you would have to imprint these quite a few times probably maybe like 10 times with our rates to actually get a full imprint so i don't know we got it there anyway <laughs> nice all right well we're gonna keep that guy over here uh does he have any food actually i did not even give him any that was a really dumb idea here you go here's some food enjoy eat eat up please <laughs> all right so let's go over here and check the pet actually are you fully grown yet i don't think you are can i mount him no okay all right well we still have that one there i never cleared him out oh my god what the hell I'm so confused. Is that one a mut- Does he have a mutation underneath his wings there or something? That looks so strange. Get out of there, man. Oh my god, whoa! Okay, so he didn't have a mutation, he just had his little friend. <laughs> Can I get in here? This is like a bad pen. But it, it kind of works. <laughs> Alright, let me out. Yeah. Okay, put that back. So, these two don't look mutated. So we're going to leave these to the phoenix, probably. Uh, yeah, so we're just going to clear these guys up, and we have a little bit to go, probably, on... How, how many... How long? Okay, 98%. Nice. He's almost done. He's almost done. Okay. Let's just go over here. Oh, are you okay? Oh, I thought he was bloody for a second. Man, that scared me. Let's go over here and just finish these guys off really quick. Um, so, yeah. We have a little bit to go left on that freaking griffin. He's, by the way, he is following the um, the phoenix. That's why he keeps, like, running after me. Um, oh, you're not dead? The hell? So, uh, yeah, I guess we'll, we'll definitely want to check out this, this griffin thing, though. And see how powerful they are when they are imprinted. Could be pretty insane. Can I get this one that's in here? Alright, got him. I think. Let me see. How are you doing? 99. Okay, yeah, we can wait around for this. Nice. Uh, he hasn't dropped an Emperor Dig, has he? Okay, good. I'm just making sure. Uh, we have another one in here. Okay. Oh, man, what the hell? One just popped out straight away. What is your color? What is your face? Let me see. I can't can't see it all all right let's leave him in there for the moment well this thing is fully grown up now those are some good stats those are some really good stats that melee is a little bit low but it, actually you know what no it needs to be updated oh wait is he a little bit faster he kind of feels like he might be i don't know why um all right let's test him out then nothing's following me right okay good see how much damage we can do with this thing whoa he's a little bit glitchy i just noticed i think we need to we need to get a level to make him stop glitching like this so let's go over here really quick and just kill something um is there anything at all what the hell is everything the hell there's usually tons of stuff right there damn it all right all right we got some stuff over here All right, well, we do 184 damage just by hitting normally. Oh, my God. That is a lot of damage. We definitely got a level from that. <laughs> just wait for that thing to pop in. That is a lot of damage. Holy crap. I mean, we could even kill things by just, like, hitting them normally. Uh, all right. Oh, my God. We got a lot of levels there. Um... Uh, all right, so the rest of his stats have updated now. Pretty freaking good. Definitely be pumping a lot into Stam, because Stamina is something that you definitely need. I seem to be doing a hell of a lot of damage already, so I don't know if I'd really pump a whole lot into Melee. Just make him, like, pretty tanky, add some Stam, give him some weight. A little bit of weight, at least, maybe to get him to, like, a 1,000 or so. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty good. Oh, we gotta land. <laughs> oh, crap. Uh, do I just, there's my parachute. Okay. Oh, man. Hey, where are you going? Hey, what are you doing? Stop. <laughs> the hell was that? I don't like that. Alright. Oh, I'm dying here a little bit, but I should be okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> 
Oh, that is so much damage. That is ridiculous. No way. All right, we gotta land for some more stam. Holy crap. Oh my god, this, this, like, imprinting griffins, holy crap. This is just gonna be insane. We're just gonna have the most OP griffins ever. What am I doing? I should not be doing that. I should get stam first. We're gonna have the most OP griffins ever. What the hell are you doing? Is he still following the thing? What is he doing? I'm so confused. What are you doing? You're not on Wander. Oh wait, he is? Did I just turn him on Wander there by accident? I'm so confused. Alright, whatever. He's got enough stamp to get us back to base. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, mutated griffins. Frickin' imprinted griffins that are OP as all hell. This is just ridiculous. <laughs> Oh man, I cannot wait to check out like other creatures with this mod with the like maybe the like the rock golems things like that I don't know could definitely work some wonders with this All right, what do we got any more babies in here? Uh, we gotta just pop everything on passive. Oh, I can see some in there. They're loading in uh, Is that a new mutated one there? No, okay thought I saw something. What is that? So confused. Oh something glitchy there. Um, can we kill this one? Apparently not. Alright, well, we'll be back in a little bit. Maybe we'll do some more breeding, try to get another creature that is maybe mutated? I don't know. Or maybe we'll just get this one fully grown or something. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, are you okay? He's okay. Just not eating quick enough. There you go. <laughs> Oh man. All right, well, we'll be back in a little bit. Okay, so they keep pooping them through the frickin' wall, but uh, we have a new, oh God. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me, seriously. I, I'm not getting used to that weird noise. We got a new mutation here. It's like a green. Looks frickin' cool. Um, so yeah, this is it here. It looks really cool. Uh, let's check out this other one that I got. This is like a purple. Um, I don't know what I'll combine with the green. Probably the blue, to be honest. I think this one's probably fully grown up at this stage. Are you? Uh, I think you are, yeah. I would have said, like, juvenile. Sweet! So we have a really amazing looking blue, a really cool looking purple, and also a green one as well, which I'm really excited about. So, uh, yeah, this is a really successful day so far. I think next what we're gonna do is maybe we'll try to breed these two together. Uh, wait, actually, crap. Wait, no, they don't have genders. Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, no, that's me killing something. Oh, that was confusing for a second. Um, yeah, so we'll, we'll breed these two together eventually, and uh, we'll have like a green, blue, and white. I think that might look pretty cool. This is a really nice looking green as well, by the way. Holy crap. Very vibrant. I really like it. But uh, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this purple one here. Um, I didn't bring you guys back for this because it really didn't look like something that was all that special. I mean, it's pretty cool looking, but eh, it's okay. <laughs> Let's check it out and see if they've laid another one here. Or laid another one. Birthed another one. <laughs> uh, do we have... I don't see one in there. Okay, so I bet one's about to come out any second now. But uh, I really like this one. It's a very, very nice color. Cannot wait to actually... Uh, to breathe this up with the other one there. Man. So freaking amazing. I guess we can wait around for this next griffin to pop out. Because it's probably going to pop out any second now. I think it's this one here that's the female. Um... The way it is stuck right now, I think it's probably going to just poop it straight out the wall. So I guess we can stand over here. But yeah, actually, let's check out the stats on this little guy here. Um, so I don't know what stats are also getting mutated with these. I think... Health it looking... It looks a little bit higher than usual. Oh, that one there is imprinted already. Uh, I can't check on the other one there because that one's already imprinted. Ah, uh, crap. Okay. Oh, look, there's another one. Hey, what are you? Doesn't look like a mutation. I'll check it anyway. Man, they are so cool. No, no mutation. And goodbye. Okay, well, we have our griffin. <laughs> Pretty freaking amazing looking. Let me just take this away. Oh, man. Does this thing look awesome? So it's got the green from that one there. It's got the blue from that one there. And it's also got the blue or the white even from the front, which is great looking. Oh, my God. 
This griffin is awesome. Now, I don't know if this is going to be the last griffin that we're going to have. Like, I think I kind of want to see if we can... Oh my god, that tail is so weird. I think I kind of want to see if we can get some other cool combinations at some point. I mean, I'd really like, like, a red one or something. I don't know, like, red wings or something like that. I think that could be pretty cool. But I gotta say, this one right here is amazing. Because you can see there's, like, a blue streak. Um, let me pull out here. You can see it like right along here, there's like a blue streak along the wing there and it kind of separates the green and the white. Looks freaking insane looking. It's also got the yellow down here. I don't think that's like a region that can be mutated uh, and as well as the beak as well. Oh my god, there's like a little bit of uh, the green there as well. Oh my god, doesn't that look awesome? Well, we're going to have to wait for this thing to fully grow up and uh, obviously get imprinted and everything. Hopefully we can get a full imprint. Uh, hopefully it's not like a kibble like that I don't have or something. That would be terrible. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited, guys. I'll bring you guys back when this thing is fully grown up, which is going to be a long time away from now. So I'll see you then. Well, doesn't this thing look amazing? All right, we got we to gotta kill something and get a level so I can stop this weird glitchiness. There we go. Oh man, I think, oh my god, we do a hell of a lot more damage than the last one. Holy. Okay, maybe this one has like a melee mutation or something. Uh, Alright, well, oh my god, look at that health. Oh, the stats on this thing are insane. Okay, wait for all of these to jump up now once I pump something in. Oh my god. Holy crap. Alright, well, definitely stamina. Want to be pumping that up to 1500, maybe 2000, we'll see. Want to get this up to 30,000, and then we'll see about the rest of the stats, because honestly, these things are already powerful enough. Like, I'll be able to kill things really easily with this. Uh, I should definitely put on some fur this time. Uh, one. Uh, where's the other one? There it is. Two. I'll just put those on, I should be good. I'm actually too hot here, because these fur pieces are really overpowered. That was a 156 mammoth. How many hits? Two? Holy crap. All right, well, let's uh, t let's take a little look around here and see if we can find some uh, some trouble. Got a Diplo there, meh. Guess we can kill these Stegos here. It seems like it's almost quicker, but it can't be quicker. Oh, I passed by the Stegos, I guess. Oh my God, one hit on that Diplo. It's only a level 18, but still amazing. Oh, they're mate boosted. That's why it didn't do so much damage. Guess I could just sit here and kill this thing. Only gonna take a second. Or maybe not, actually. This thing, uh, yeah, let's do a swoop. Why can't I fly? Oh, I'm out of stam. Holy crap, I didn't even realize. Let's wait for some stam to come in here. And do a little bit of a swoop, kill all those guys. <laughs> Murdered everything. Everything just died. That's great. All right, so we need more stam, definitely. We just like tear through all of that. Take those, I'll take the hide as well. Don't really need the rest of it, but I'll leave the food in there. All right, we'll sit at, mm, we're not at 1500 yet. We'll get at 1500 and then we'll see what we're at when we have uh, 30k health. Uh, was that level six? I think, I didn't catch that. I think it said level six, we'll find out soon. Bam! That was the 168 Carno I just killed. Where's this, uh, there he is. 66, that's what he was. Nice, and we got his lung. Anything else down here at all? There's an RG. Holy crap! <laughs> oh my god, this thing is so overpowered. It's ridiculous. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Let me grab these out before I accidentally drop them. Definitely need all of this stuff, especially the hide. Gonna need a huge amount of hide for all of the saddles that we have to build for the boss arena. Alright, let's head back and get a second swipe in there. And he's dead. <laughs> Alright, so there's usually a bunch of stuff over here, so we'll head over there. Nice. Hello, moose, and you're dead. And some mammoths here. Everything's just dying. Everything's dying. <laughs> Let's do a dive bomb on these guys here. Because we do need to get some stam. 
Oh, what the hell? That didn't work. Oh, God. <laughs> that didn't work. I think I kind of pulled up or something a little bit. Oh, my God. Wow. All right. Let's get one little swoop in here really quick. And then we can stop for some stem. Oh, <laughs> God. I just murdered everything. I just killed everything there. Holy crap. All of the items. I will take that pelt. I'll take that pelt just because. Um, you coming in to attack me here? <laughs> Get dive bombed. All right, ready? Oh, didn't work. Damn it. Oh, God. What the hell? Nice. And he's dead. All right, we got some rhinos over there. Um, holy... 11 levels. Okay, so definitely more into stam. Let's get the stam to 2,000, because seriously, like, we'll need that much. For sure. Uh, Alright, let's kill all these rhinos and get some rhino horns. Because I do want to mess around with the uh, potions. Actually, wait, no, we can't even use those anymore, because we're already level 100. I don't think you can ascend on this map yet, so... Damn, that sucks. Oh, we don't even need those things anymore. Although, actually, yeah, no, we do need them if we want to tame some Arthur Pleuras. Uh, what I'm talking about is the Broth of Enlightenment, which is like a potion that you can use to level. And you need Rhino Horns to, to uh, get that. Or you could also use, um, what are they called? Those things, you know, you know those things with the stuff? Uh, Deathworm Horns, there we go. That's the word. And he's dead. And you're also going to be dead, little dire wolf. <laughs> oh, man. All right. More stam. Oh, hey, dire wolf. You want to play? You want to go? Come on. Get some. Damn it. <laughs> that didn't work at all. Let's get one little swoop in here and kill them both. Uh, and I hit the ground, of course. Uh, I still got them, though. Technically did not fail. Okay. Um, let's head into this cave and kill some uh, dire bears. I don't know if I'll be able to kill them in such uh, close quarters, but they're very high level, so it's a good idea to do it. Uh, I'm, am I, what the hell's happening right now? Why can't I go fast? I don't know why. I just kill things like this, I guess. Uh, so hide, pelt, holy crap. <laughs> Rhino horns, look at that, three of them. Nice. All right, I'm going to drop all that for now. We're going to get more. Don't worry. Uh, let's head into that cave. I believe the entrance is over here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there it is. And there's a rhino outside. I can't not kill this thing. Die, die, die. It's dead. <laughs> oh, man. All right, we're gonna get a little bit of a lag spike here for a second. Oop, and we're okay, I think. Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, this is such a cool cave. I like the way that you can fly into here, though. Holy, okay, though, that was only a low level. I was gonna say, like, that was confusing because like, these things can be like up to level 500 in here, it's crazy. Uh, 120. Interesting. Where are the high level ones? Oh man, there's like dire bears everywhere. Look at all of them. Uh, kill that one. Hit that one. Didn't kill him. <laughs> oh, I thought that was another dire bear, but it just turned out to be a rock. Don't you hate when that happens? You think it's a dire bear, but it's actually a rock. Always happens. All right, let's uh, let's check out these guys here really quick, and maybe we can check out some of these drops. I just killed a baby Kairuku. Oops, and a normal Kairuku. Oops. Uh, we gotta take you off. Okay, we gotta name him actually. I don't know what I want to name him though. Uh, hmm. We're gonna definitely have to think of a really cool name for this thing. Like a super awesome name, guys. I need something. Uh, holy crap. 
Scorpion saddle. Amazing. Maybe we'll do some scorpion breeding now because we can. Not that I ever wanted to, but you know, we can now. <laughs> With this new amazing bot that we have. Uh. Oh, damn, I thought I'd get a speed boost for that. Hey, there we go. Alright, let's kill the rest of them by just sitting here. 204, what's the other one? And a 216. Nice. Alright, let's see what we get. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. Everything's just ascendant. I wish I hadn't have turned up the drops, but we can't turn them back down now. I see a lot of people have kind of like complained about that throughout the series. Like guys, we I didn't know what I was doing when I did that, and uh, by the time we'd already done it, people had already pulled some stuff that they, at that point, they were like, hey, I kind of don't want to part with this. And at the same time, like, I kind of didn't want to part with some of the stuff that I was getting too, because like, I like good loot. <laughs> So, um, you know, obviously we're not going to turn up the drop rates the same way that we have on this series ever again, um, on any server that we have. Like, the, the drop rates, the drop quality on here is insane. It's to the point where it's actually silly. Uh, everything's ascendant. You can get other ones, but most of them are ascendant, which is just insane. It's just ridiculous. Uh, it devalues ascendant completely, we know, but uh, we won't be doing it again, don't worry. Uh, and it's also not like this on the vanilla series, which seems to be a, a big confusion. Uh, a lot of people seem to think that we also have it the same on there, but we actually don't. We haven't even turned it up on there, I don't believe. So, yeah. Um, let's fight some Darbers. Hey, buddy. All right. So, yeah, guys, that's probably going to be it for today. Uh, this has been a long episode. <laughs> I, I guarantee it's probably past 30 minutes i think it's probably run around 35 minutes by now so yeah we'll end it off here if you guys enjoyed the video go ahead and beat the crap out of that like button if you guys want to see more like this subscribe and uh we're obviously going to be checking out some of the other amazing creatures that we can now breed using this amazing mod um so yeah that's that's definitely coming up oh man i'm so excited i'll see you guys next time <laughs>